and good morning what is up guys so uh, it's, what time is it here right now it's 6 37 getting the coffee ready uh, I thought we would do something unique this uh, stream basically I woke up this morning uh, one of the guys I follow on a forum he posted uh, that Fanatec is releasing a podium hub and a podium wheel I think we all knew about the wheel the R I think it's the R300, but we're going to take a look ourselves because I don't know anything about them. So I thought we can actually look at it, kind of see what they're about, and see if we're going to be interested or not. But I'm sure we will be because why wouldn't we be? Let me get you guys settled in. I got the coffee poured. I got my wireless keyboard on next to the rig. Ooh, good morning. Alrighty, can you guys see what I'm seeing? I think you can. Alright, let's go and make sure the... There we go. Let's set this up in a way where it's not conflicting. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. So here it is. Can you guys see it? Yes, you can. So this is the Podium Hub. All right, let's see what else it's about. Let's take a look at some of the pictures. Very interesting wheel. I like the gold immediately. The gold already attracts me, I'm thinking. So, hmm, what else do I think about it? Let's click at more pictures. All right, what I see here is a, a plug-in, which is something they're not known for. Typically, everything is built in. Are they trying to go modular? Very quite possibly. What's up? Good morning. What else do I think about it? That's uh, okay. So now that we know that's up, let's continue looking at it. Interesting. So it's funny because I just ordered the, um, the, the, the Club Sport Hub. It was like 249 and I'm thinking, why did I even order it? Actually, I think it was like three something. We'll, we'll check on that. But I would have ordered this because obviously I'm running a podium. Very interesting. So everything looks the same back here, as you can see. Let's go ahead and go forward. I'm really liking that. Well, you'll never see it, but it looks clean. The cool thing is, is if you're running like a Momo wheel. Here, let me grab my Momo wheel so you guys can see. By the way, this was given to me by a very special man. Probably one of the coolest dudes I've ever met in my life. Unfortunately, I let him down again. Um, but he did give me this. It's a Momo wheel. It's an excellent wheel. You, you're not going to find anything better on the market. But what's cool is, is if you see this, it's open. You'll see the Fanatec F. Very cool, very cool for aftermarket wheels. Alrighty, what do we got here? Electronics. Interesting, why do you need electronics really if it's just a standalone hub? Are they trying to go modular? So you could add, ooh, there we go, the pins without the sprue. Well, from what I first saw with that, uh, that little USB or I don't know what you call that little outlet, this one. That's telling me to plug something in. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. Let's go ahead and dive into it a little. Podium hub, the ultimate core for your modular steering wheel. Okay. We're getting there. <laughs> so they are going for a modular kind of feel. Maybe they'll sell aftermarket modular stuff as well. Morning, Bambino. The podium hub is the core component for the Fanatec modular steering wheel system. Okay, I'm digging. What about you? You digging? Me too, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me, oh, just pinky. Alrighty, the aluminum, musky, the space frame surrounds the electronic components for the lightest possible weight. Interesting, so it's like, probably like a high grade, uh, what do you call, high grade plastic? And then the shield itself is the uh, the golden aluminum. 
Okay, the central hub is created from a single piece of anodized aluminum. I was wrong, guys, for maximum strength. Uh, high performance central core integrating a dedicated ARM processor. The podium hub is low latency, firmware upgradable. Okay, 10 buttons and dual 16 bit resolution for analog inputs. Interesting, analog. Huh. Additional buttons can be connected via the data port. So that's what it is, a data port. Very interesting. Getting more exciting every second I read. I'm really liking the hub. What do you guys think of it? Hmm. Let's continue reading. Let's see if we can make this a little bigger. I, I got told you guys, I don't know crap about all this computer stuff. I'm just some dude. Here we go, here we go. There we go. We got more real estate. Customize, customization and flexibility. Wheel rim compatibility. The podium features mounting holes for the wheels using 6 by 17 millimeter and 3 by 70. So that will work for this. Uh, possible to run on th third party wheels on PC with USB cables as used on. Oh, interesting. Interesting where they're going with their market. Supports podium series modular components. Okay, so as you guys all know, the new paddle shifters, which I ordered, we'll do a whole video on building up this wheel, tearing it apart, and putting on the new magnetics. I think they're going to be really good. The podium hub contains connectors to the podium advanced pedals modular, two universal hub buttons, clusters, and data port connectors for attaching the Anatech buttons on display. So they're going what we've always asked Thrustmaster to do. You know how Thrustmaster would release an F1 rim and kind of leave it empty like they were going to release something for it? They never do. All right, let's go and keep looking. Interchangeable quick release. Mm, this includes the club fork quick release adapter. Allows you to connect directly to, oh, okay, and putting wheel bases. Uh, automotive grade, we already know all that. Automotive grade, this is definitely straight out of a real race car. Sometimes it feels like interchangeable. But yeah, the data port, now we know what it is and we know that's going to be very key in the success of what they're trying to go for. They're not just trying to go to sell us a rim. They want to sell us something that you can build up your whole own racing rim, which is really cool. Okay, let's go ahead and jump down to the features. Gold anodized aluminum. Obviously, I want gold because I love gold. Alrighty. Ultra sturdy, lightweight, space frame, two connectors to the podium, advanced uh, pedal module. Oh, okay. Uh, is there any information in here releasing other information? One data port connector to feature ex future accessories. <laughs> the future's accessories including button module endurance. Okay, we're going to get there, because I have a feeling I know what it is. So let's keep moving. As the sun's coming in, I might get blind out from you guys, but I love you. Uh, except a third-party rim using... Ooh. Uh, let's keep going. It's compatible with the DD1, DD2, with all the club sports and the seal. Oh, wow, guys. This is something for everybody. So this is it, guys. Um... It's $199.95 right now. I can actually pre-order it, which I'm going to. Um, I, I'm a firm believer now of pre-ordering from Fanatec. When I first pre-ordered the motor from them, my first purchase from them, um, I was scared because they put it on hold for like, I think it was like seven months. So, but I, with this one, I believe in. All right, well, let's go check out the other Podium product, which I'm quite excited for. And here it is, the Podium Steering Wheel R300. Oh! And it's for PS4 and PC. I don't own a PS4, probably never will, but I kind of would like to. PlayStation, send me one. I'll play GT Sport. Look at that. Oh, she is a pretty girl. Look at that. I love the gold nuts. Bolts, I mean. Duh. But look at the stitching. The stitching looks like straight out of an MPI wheel. It just looks quality. Wow. Wow, very 
very, very nice. I wonder how the leather is going to hold up. So they have the obviously upgraded uh, paddle shifter pack. So that's why this rim is so expensive. The rim itself would be expensive by itself. That's like a $200 rim. And then anodized bolts. That's not too expensive, but it, it can get pricey. And then I'm assuming this is the endurance button package for the modular system. I believe this wheel is the complete everything. Very interesting. Let's take more look at it. Ooh, look at that back stitching. Kind of messy right here, but still works. But look at that. That is just a gorgeous room. <sighs> wow. I love the uh, carbon fiber uh, weaving of the golden. That's really pretty. Yeah, guys, I definitely got to have this wheel. Fanatec, send me one. Look at that. That's just a complete professional built wheel. No cut corners. That's when I hate is when people start to cut corners. How much is this thing? Four, five hundred dollars. Wow, that's expensive, but probably extremely worth it because just the paddle shifters which I ordered were almost two hundred bucks. So yeah, you're getting a pretty good deal because you're also getting the endurance package of the uh, button box. So let's read what all this is about. An ideal multi-purpose wheel. The podium steering wheel R300 is a high-end multi-purpose wheel. This product combines the podium wheel rim R300 podium hub. So you get the hub, which is by itself is what? 200. Uh, the podium advanced paddle modules, which are 150, and a club sport button cluster pack. Okay, so we know now that these are not, not the endurance pack from the podium series. This is the club sport. But what's cool is these are plugged in to those ports. Interesting. Automotive grade materials, the podium wheel rim R300 is made in brushed and anodized aluminum. And interesting. And covered in premium smooth leather and gold stitching. Gold anodized aluminum bolts are included. Making this wheel a good all around suitable for maneuverable vehicles. Yes. Uh, la, 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 la. Aluminum. Aluminum. I can't even say that word. Okay, so the podium space frame design supports electronic components. Yeah, we already read all about that. Is there anything special about this rim besides everything that's on it? Customization and flexibility. Create your perfect steering wheel. See? Easily upgrade and customize Fanatex modular components. So they're going modular, which everyone I feel is. Yep. Phone companies, most electronic companies are going like modular. Uh, Elgato, another modular company. Uh, for the podium advance, uh, pedal button box, da, 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 adjustable button cluster, wheel room compatibility. So we already know about that. The most authentic paddle system ever. Uh, da, 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 the featuring magnetic shifters and hall sensors. You guys already know about this, I'm sure, but we'll go over it again. It's the pa uh, paddle modular and the ultimate shifter and paddle system for your Fanatic steering wheel. So basically, it's basically all magnetic. So if I pull this off right now, back here, these come off and you install those, which you'll get your clutch, your two clutches, You'll get two paddle shifters, which I don't know why you would need two, but that's just me. Um, but basically, what that rim already comes with it. I had to order the actual paddle shifters for this rim. So we'll leave this room right here because it's so pretty. I get to stare at it more. Okay, uh, the sensational feel, unbeatable performance, the magnetic. More than just dual clutch. The paddles allow you... Four different modes on supported wheels. Uh, ooh, advanced clutch bite points modes. Yeah, so on this I have that actually. 
the brake throttle mode, and mappable access mode. Interesting. That's good to know. Look at that weaving. Oof, still, still addicted. All right, so the podium wheel rim, R300. Okay. Then you get the podium paddle module, which is the four magnetic pedals. And then you get the podium hub, modular design, premium automotive, anodized, smooth leather, real carbon fiber, uh, hall sensors with the analog paddles. Uh, it works with the podium DD1, DD2, uh, the PS4 version of the podium, the club sport wheel V2, 2.4, and the CLSL elite wheel bases. Uh, very cool. What does it include? Uh, podium wheel rim. A podium rim. Huh. Additional set of gold anodized aluminum bolts. That is cool, guys. Because I can make other rims, like this one, have gold pattern. Very neat. I like that. Alrighty. Alright, guys. So that's a quick look at what I woke up to this morning. I woke up to this, uh, one of my friends on a uh, group that I follow, they uh, posted this, and I was just like, what? No! Yeah! I couldn't believe it. It was amazing, amazing news for the day, to start the day. But um, yeah, I like this. Let's go back to the hub real quick and just take a quick snap out of it. Very nice. Now, I'm here in America, so let's see in North America if it's even available on their actual North American website, because it's, from what I think, it's not. Hmm, I don't see nothing. Do you guys see these? These are the mounting brackets. I can't use them because I don't have nothing to mount like that, too, but very nice. Look at those. Podium mounting brackets, the strongest way to mount a podium series direct drive system. Okay, guys, let me know down in the comments what what uh, chassis I should get to mount these, because I like them. I like gold. Uh, specially designed to bolt the side mounts. Okay. So this centers the motor. This binds it together. It's kind of like one ring to rule them all. All right, I love this, guys. This is amazing. All right, so we have three podium products listed, if you look. The podium mounting brackets, the podium uh, steering wheel R300, and the podium hub. So the family is growing just very slowly. And you know what? Anything that's going to be worth it is going to take time, and I would rather wait anyways. And as you guys can see, you can still pre-order a DD2 for $4.99. That's actually really good, guys. Um, why you guys have not yet, I don't know, but the, oh my god, the Podium F1 USA wheel is, it wasn't that much, oh, that must be the price rise. Alrighty guys, well that's my look at the Podium selection of, uh, I didn't mean to do the brackets, but there's the brackets, and then there's the R300 wheel, and there's the hub. If you guys have any questions, definitely hit me up, um, I'm going to be doing some live streaming, uh, I do uh, coffee and guns in the morning, and then I go ahead and get in the simulator and race with friends. If you guys ever want to join a race with us, let us know down in the comments. Maybe we'll do some uh, competizioni, or maybe we'll do um, a set of Corsa lobby, a custom one. Uh, but let us know down in the comments what you guys like. And if you guys like this, hit that smash button for subscribe and like, please. I want to grow and be part of the community in the biggest way. You guys have a great one. I'll talk to you guys later.